Hi, I'm Dr. Charlie Peterson. I'm the author of Dude, Where's My Profit? The Accounting Finally Makes Sense mini course. Today I want to talk about an adjustment for a current asset, specifically prepaid insurance. Prepaid insurance is insurance paid for in advance. First thing we want to do is we want to set up our T accounts here. Cash, prepaid insurance, notes payable, and insurance expense. Okay to abbreviate. Now, the, on January 1st, we, which is the beginning of our accounting period, we borrowed $2,000 cash from the bank and gave the bank a note payable for that amount. So our, we're going to debit cash for $2,000. For $2, and we're going to credit notes payable for $2,000. Now, on April 1st, we purchased a one-year insurance policy for $1,200 paying cash. So we have a $1,200 insurance policy here, and we paid cash for it. Now we come to the end of our accounting period, and we need to make an adjustment for the insurance that was used up. Right now, the balance in prepaid insurance shows $1,200. That's overstated. Insurance expense shows a balance of zero. That's understated. Now I'm going to do a little timeline here so we can figure out how much of an expense gets assigned to our current accounting period and how much of an expense will become part of the next accounting period. Here's January 1st, December 31st, January 1st, December 31st. Now here's April 1st and we purchased a one-year insurance policy. This is April 1st and it's going to expire on March 31st. So this amount here for the whole insurance policy is $1,200. But we're only interested in this portion right here because that's the portion that got used up in this accounting period. Now if we count April to December, that's nine months or $900 of insurance got used up during that period. So what we're going to do is we're going to decrease our prepaid insurance by 900 and increase insurance expense by 900. This becomes your adjustment and when we rebalance this account we see that we have prepaid insurance of $300. And this $300 will become an expense of the next accounting period. All right? Now, the prepaid insurance of $300 will appear on the balance sheet. The $900 worth of insurance expense will appear on the uh, income statement under operating expenses. All right? Please let other people know about this website, and I thank you for viewing.